Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I wanted to share with you one of my hobbies, and that is planting. It's a bright, sunny, and windy morning here. And take a look at that long tree that is Moringa olifera or Malungay. This Malungay tree was planted 16 years ago and take a look how tall that is. See, look at that. Malungay is a fast-growing tree, drought-resistant, that is so famous among the Filipinos. Moringa olifera is very nutritious. Malungay is rich in antioxidants. It also lowers the blood sugar levels, reduces inflammation, and can lower cholesterol. Malunga is so easy to plant, retain, prune, and replant cut stems. Take a look at this stem that I replanted for about two weeks already. It grew so fast. I also planted cotton fruit or what we call santol in Tagalog. But I always cut it, prune it so that it won't grow big. Another plant I have is alugbate, which is also known as Basilia, Malabar spinach, Indian spinach, or vine spinach. Alugbate contains small amounts of essential vitamins and minerals like phosphorus, selenium, vitamin B5, and zinc. Alugbate plant tends to grow so fast during the rainy season and dries up during the summer. I also planted aloe veras for almost three years now, and these are some of the pots. Few weeks from now, I will be replanting these little pops of aloe veras so that they can grow big individually in their pots. I plant aloe veras because it has an antioxidant and antibacterial properties. It also accelerates the healing of birds. Aloe vera plants doesn't need much water, so it's easy to maintain. Early this year, I started replanting snake plants. I believe it cleans air better than most other indoor plants as it has the ability to absorb excessive amounts of carbon monoxide. Like the aloe veras, it is very easy to maintain. Snake plants need very small amount of water so maintenance is very easy i also use aloe vera for my face to prevent wrinkles fight skin aging and it reduces also infection and acne twice a week i apply aloe vera gel on my hair to fight hair loss and also to prevent dandruff I apply aloe vera gel for my skin as moisturizer and soothing and healing burns. There you go friends. Next video, I will be showing you how to do the replanting. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Shalom. God bless all of you. Bye-bye.